So what if we, we got here? So we have quantum locking. The, the superconductor is locked in space and it stays wherever I put it. You see, this is quantum trapping. It's amazing. As, as long as it's so the super is superconducting, it's can frozen with liquid nitrogen. It upside down. Right. And it stays locked. So the fact that it's it's superconducting is locking the magnetic field in yeah. three dimensions, right? Yeah, exactly. And that's and you see, because this is a sy symmetric, it can rotate without breaking without break the locking. The locking doesn't break. Right. Because it so it stays there on the the x and y, but not on. But the, it pivots on the yeah on the axis yeah. of the magnet. You, you see, if yeah. I can move it yeah. on the side, it will again pivot around the axis of the magnet because it makes sure that uh, the magnetic field inside of it stays the same. Right. It's astonishing. Can you put it on the track for us? Yeah. I just levitate it above the track quite high, and I can just rotate it. So it's actually floating above the surface. Yeah, it's not floating, it's locked above the surface. So it could you could tilt it at an angle and it would yeah, still fly it around. Yeah, like this, and it could just go around like this. I could just go and put it at different height, and then like this. You lock it at the height. Lock right. it, yeah, different height, different configuration. Right. And I can even lock it at the uh, opposite way. If you could just hold for a minute, high. I'm doing the same so thing, I'm locking down. it upside down, and then it is suspended. Fantastic. Okay.